Hello, hello, Crafty Mantis here, and welcome to the December Minecraft Hardcore Challenge. So this month's challenge is the Treeless Challenge. We are going to be in Hardcore, as always. For the World Seed, we are going to be doing 25 as 71. We want to be in large biomes with structures on. Standard rules apply, which means that we can eat zombie fish, or zo zombie fish, zombie flesh, and, um... So zombie flesh and fish that we catch and then pretty much no restrictions in terms of our diet other than we can't eat, you know, like the meat of animals and stuff like that. So special rules this um, this month. We are not allowed to break any spawn trees or leaves and cultivated, cultivated trees are okay. So what that means is that if we grow the tree... Hmm. I don't think we're going to have to worry about trees. Interesting. Lovely. Okay. Um, <laughs> so if we actually plant the tree, then we are allowed to um, actually cut it down. But we can't do any spawn trees. But I don't, I don't see any spawn trees. So I don't think that's going to be a problem right now. So uh, first thing that we need to do is we need to head to one nine, negative 192, negative 209. Apparently there is wood... Yeah, we need to go this way. So 192 and negative 209. All right. So we're going to be heading in this direction. So heading, can we can we swim, please? Head in this. Yep, in this direction. And supposedly there is wood and iron in this direction. So let's, for one, let's not drown. Oh, I see. I see uh, ruins over there. So we are going to try to avoid that. So negative 192, let's see, is it this, yeah, this way is, yeah, oh, wow, this is gonna, this is, this is gonna take a while, but supposedly there is wood over here, and so maybe, just maybe, we can get a boat out of this, and then uh, make this a little bit easier, because after we get this wood and iron, we need to be going and, um, going to a village, is our next stop a little bit of lag there we're loading in chunks that's all right oh oh i see i wonder if that is what we are heading towards the um the shipwreck that's over there wow this is <laughs> this is lovely blue lots and lots of blue come on dolphins give me the, give me give me the dolphins grace oh no drowning let's see negative 192 209 Okay, whoa, 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 we passed it, passed it, yeah, okay, so it is, it is this here, okay. So, let's come down here. Nice, ah, whoa, lots of leg, okay, ah, we need, we, ah, we need air, we need air. Right, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, up, 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 all right, there we go. Oh, <sighs> okay. Um... Let's see. All right, let's come back down here. Let's see if we can't. Ugh. Oh, okay. Yeah, we we're not we're not swimming, so we can't get through that hole. Oh my goodness, air is definitely a problem over here. Um, let's see. I wonder is the door is there a door down here? There is. Okay, so that that'll make it a little bit easier. Okay, what do we got in here? All right, we got a buried treasure map. That'll come in handy possibly later. Um, let's go ahead and break this. All right, and then what we can do is let's go ahead and grab this wood. Because we're doing pretty good on time, and then with the fact that we can actually breathe in this little pocket, it makes it easier for us to bust the wood up. So let's go ahead and break this stuff, and then we can go back and get the other stuff that was in the um in the other chest so let's go ahead and take the f3 screen off for right now as we get all this lovely wood so much wood and then the next step is we're supposed to be going to a village which is at negative 442 negative 721 so we've got a track ahead of us so i definitely want to make sure that we have um at least a pick and a sword because we are most likely going to end up hitting mobs 
um, I want to be able to get to the village so that I can kind of see what um, what um, buildings and stuff are there, so we can kind of plan out what you know what we can um, what we can build. All right, so we should be able to come in here and get the rest of this chest. Break, 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 break. All right, here we go. It's breaking, and hopefully it breaks before I run out of air, which is not gonna happen. All right, we're drowning. We're drowning. Get air. All right. So yeah, we're not we're not doing that. We're just gonna have to yeah we're just gonna have to um, come over here and just grab this lovely stuff and we'll leave the chest there since we can't breathe up there. All right. So there is that. So how much wood do we have? None because it all floated to the top. All right. So let's come up here, gather up this stuff, and see. We've got a pretty good start to what we have for wood. Let's see, we've got six, five, and then three logs. Um, let's come down here. Find the, find that again. All right. So, and the thing with the village too, if they have farms, we could end up grabbing some of the wood around the farms as well. Um, cause those are usually covered in oak, potentially. Um, we'll definitely have to see because if it is a desert village, then, um, we might have some issues. All right. So that gets us a pretty decent and let's see at three screen again. Okay. So we do need to come in this direction. So we need to travel another like 700 blocks. So let's get over here to the land and see about making ourselves a boat. Because if we have the boat, then it should be easy to come over here. So if we do not have enough wood, then we can come back here and get some of it. But I definitely want to get to the village. We're about midday right now. So we're doing, we're doing good. Um, so let's pop up here and let us get a boat going. So let's go ahead and convert these over. So we want to get a boat. And then let's go ahead and craft ourselves up a sword just in case. And oh, let's do that. And a pick. So those will definitely come in handy. Um, so let's go ahead and break this. And then we can start heading over towards where the village is. All right. In there. And the great thing is we can eat kelp this time around as well. So that will definitely come in handy. So we'll definitely have to remember where this is. And then that way, in case we need to, we can come back. But let's go ahead and head in this direction. So the village is at negative 442, negative 721. Um, and I'm seeing a whole lot of desert. So that might mean that, um, yeah... We might be in a desert. Ooh, and I see sugar cane over there. Lots of cactus. All right. So we are about to 442. Hi, Vigies. And then let's come over here. Ooh, 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 lag. All right. So, yeah, it looks like we... Yeah, there, there it is. Right there. Right there. I see it. Though I also see a blacksmith. Awesome. All right, so let's go ahead and come over here. That way we can just park our boat right next to the village. Hello, village. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. All right. Boat is in place. Oh, okay. I'm going to stand here and let it load in a little bit because it is definitely getting a little jerky on the recording. There we go. All right, so let's see what the village offers us. What do we get? Iron, apple, and bread. Ha. Okay. Whoa. Wow. Yeah. Entities are an issue here. Okay. So that, yeah, that does not, um, I can definitely understand why this is um, the tree list challenge. Um, so I, yeah, I might have to go back and uh, destroy that wonderful um, boat some more. But let's go ahead and come down here and get some uh, foods, some food stuffs. Gotta love the food stuffs. 
because food is definitely going to be, you know, a thing. Especially since we most likely will end up having to go over to the, um, yeah. Go what? <laughs> yeah, we will definitely have to go back over to the, um, yeah, to the boat to get some more wood. Because this is, yeah, not, um, <laughs> there's not a whole lot here. Uh, no trees, nothing. So, let's see what we got. Okay, we got you in there. Um, hmm. Interesting. So now my question is, where could we possibly go in order to... Oh, you, mister. You need to quit farming. My food. <laughs> um, where we could go potentially to get saplings. Oh, and look at all those turtles. Hi, turtles. Uh, don't really need beetroot. Um, and of course the sun is starting to go down, which is always fantastic. Uh, da -da -da -da, da -da -da -da. do we have anything over here? No, because we have farmers who keep stealing all the food. Huh. Interesting. Okay. So that doesn't leave much for, yeah. Hmm. All right. Well, I guess we could come over here. Let's break some more of this kelp. Well, I don't want to use... Huh. I don't want to use my... um My wood to smelt stuff. I think I saw a cave-like structure over here. So, yeah, there is... There is a cave over here. Let's see what... Falling sand... Yeah, there is, there is definitely a cave down there. Um, I am not seeing any coal right off the bat. Um, and it is nighttime. Hi, night. <laughs> Alright, luckily it is only day one, so we don't have to worry about phantoms. We just have to worry about, um, regular mobs. Yeah, and we are definitely a bit laggy over here still. Which is most likely because of the ocean. I've noticed, oh wow. Um. There is a spider over there, um, and a creeper. I do not have a shield, but we can rectify that situation. Don't particularly want to waste any wood, but I think a shield is going to be an absolute must in this situation. All right. So let's go ahead and leave the crafting table there. Hello, Mr. Spider. How are you? I would like your string, and of course you don't give me any. Alright, so let's take on this creeper. Hi, Mr. Creeper. How are you? Do not blow up my farm, please. Yeah, I'm definitely... Oh, ah! Ah! Zombies! Zombies! Zombies and creepers! Zombies and creepers! Alright, creepers down. Zombie, 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 zombie. Ooh, and I see more spiders. Sweet! And I am... I'm hurting! I'm hurting! All right, munch, munch, munch. Let's get this munch on, and then we can take out the zombie over here, and then we can try to get the spider. Because if we can get two string, we can get. Oh, did, oh, okay. He didn't despawn. He just, he just felt. Oh, there was a couple spiders. Okay. All right. Hey, Mr. Spider. You want to come here? Come here. Yeah. Get you in the water. Ow. You still hit me. All right. Come here, spider. Oh, yes. We got string. We got one string. Oh, ow! And the other spider is attacking. All right, come here, spider. Come here. I want your string. Give me your string. No, no string. Okay. All right. Well, that was not as fruitful as I was hoping. There's lots of lots of creepers over there. There's a spider over there. Let's see if we can lure him away from these skelly bobs. Ooh, there's a couple spiders. Hey, Mr. Spider, come here. Come here, Mr. Spider. I would very much like, yes, uh, wow, he gave us two strings, okay, so we are good in that respect, we have, we now have, oh, uh, we now have string, we can make a fishing rod, so we can get food, which is going to be good, so I think this, um, this month, the, um, resource, Resource management is definitely going to be a thing. Um, let's see. Let's get the carrots back on. Yeah, resource management is definitely going to be a thing because we are, we are going to be 
low in terms of different resources, especially wood. So the biggest thing I think is going to be trying to find something that has um, has saplings in it. Um, I don't know if the buried treasure has saplings in it. So that might be something that we could end up going and exploring. Let's see. Oh, it's actually... We're actually in the map. So hold on. So it looks like we need to head east and we should be able to find it. Or maybe, yeah. So I think that is something. What? Well, I think that is something that we can end up exploring during the daytime because there is just way too many critters around here. Wait, wow! Ah, oh my goodness, so many creepers. They're everywhere. Huh? Interesting. Okay. Um. Biggest thing is, is that what, oh, and there's a husk, lovely. Hi, Mr. Husk, how are you? Get back down there, please. Keep falling, keep falling. You need to stay away from my villager friends. And now you're stuck? No, okay, you're coming, all right. All right, there we go, okay, sweet. Yeah, because the biggest thing is finding which home we want to call our own. And then go from there. Yeah, and then I think this is definitely going to need to be a exploration. Um exploration month. <laughs> Look hi, Mr. Spider. Just climbing all over that house. Oh, what is that? Ooh, okay. I got a cactus. <laughs> Not very helpful, but hey, you know, it it works. Um hmm, how much okay, so we're okay, so the night is starting to go down. Let's see. You know what? Screw it. Let's see. We needed to head east for this. So we are... Let's see. Can I get to my crafting table without getting my face eaten off? Ah, okay. That would be a no. There is a zombie. Hello, mister. Oh, there's a couple of zombies. And of course, zombies... Wah, ow. Um, zombies will be a big problem for the simple fact that we are in a village. So... All right, let's munch on this. Yeah, so that is going to be the biggest thing, is just that we got all these villagers, and they attract they attract zombies. Oh, and my sword just broke. Lovely! And there's a skelly bob. Please don't see me. Please you saw me. What? Okay. Blah. Um, <laughs> Villagers, help me! Where's my crafting table? I don't know where my crafting table went. There's my crafting table. And there's another zombie. And there's a spider. Okay, I'm not getting... Ah, there's a skelly. <laughs> and ah, I... No, no, no. Ow. Oh, oh, that's gonna hurt. Ow. Alright. Uh, no. Run right away from skelly. Run right away. Okay. Hey, Mr. Cleric, can I come in here? Oh, hi, Mr. Farmer. Hi, Mr. Cleric. Pleased to meet you. I'm just gonna hide here with you guys for a little bit. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, this is... Huh? <laughs> this is gonna be interesting. So, no wood. What do, okay, let's take stock of what we got so far. Stairs, not so helpful. Um, let's see, we got some gold. We got some armor. Or, not armor. Some iron. Some paper, emeralds, um, let's see, yeah, 38, what do you, what are, what are you, you're a fisherman, um, interesting, okay, hmm, yeah, we're gonna have to go back, we're gonna have to go back to the, um, the ship and get more wood, and then I also want to check out the buried treasure, because that may have saplings in it. Ooh, ooh, and the sun's rising. The sun's rising. And I hear lots of, you know, wonderful stuff out there. So I think the next thing is definitely going to be to um, get an iron sword. I think we need to get an iron sword. And that'll help. And then this will give us two more ingots. And then maybe a chest plate. 
yeah, I think a chest plate would probably be good to at least start us out with some armor. That way I'm not totally getting my butt kicked. <laughs> um, that, so, iron chest plate and a, um, yeah, iron chest plate and an iron sword. I think those two will definitely help us out a lot. And one of the villagers is already running around. Dude, are you crazy? There's still things out here. They're not burning yet. <laughs> oh, so, oh. A lot of you guys are out. What are you guys doing out? The zombies aren't burning. Look, there's a zombie chasing after you. And look, there's a zombie over there. Why are you guys outside of your houses? Seriously. Yeah, you're going to get hit by that zombie. The zombie's going to kill you, villager. The zombie's going to kill you. They're not burning yet. It says skeleton is. The zombie's not. There he goes. Okay. All right. So are we on day one? Where? Oh, uh, where's the day? I've lost the day. Day, okay, we're still day zero. So we haven't quite hit day one yet. But everything is burning. So let's come out here. Oh! Um, huh. There was a creeper there. <laughs> and I'm being bombarded by, um, zombies. Okay, we are officially day one. So I hope you guys enjoy this episode. Um, apparently, yeah, I have some issues. Um,. I mean, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, definitely hit that like button. If you're not already subscribed, please do so. It definitely helps out the channel. And it's always nice to see new faces in my little corner of YouTube. And then if you want to be notified as to when I put out additional content, then definitely hit that notification bell. But for now, I'm going to call it, and I will see you guys in the next episode.